Mornay Morkel guides Surrey to sensational victory over Lancashire. Josh Bohannon and Stephen Croft had done well to come through a tough evening session to leave Lancashire at 177 for 5 at the close of play on day 3. The hosts needed 5 wickets, the visitors 94 runs as they resumed on day 4. It would be a good start for the batting side. Croft and Bohannon were keenly aware of the need to preserve their wickets if they held hopes of victory, but still put on 20 runs in the first 30 minutes of the day. When Morkel got one to rise on Croft, he could only feather it through to Folks for 43 and reignite Surrey hopes of victory. The South African struck in his next over, this time a helmeted Rory Burns taking the catch at a close slip position to dismiss Bohannon for 32. Morkel had found his rhythm, taking his third of the day just a few overs later. Another rising delivery nestling in the gloves of Folks via Joe Minnie's edge. But with two wickets remaining, Lancashire found their feet. Graham Onions took on Morkel and even hit him for six. At the first interval, Lancashire needed just 24 more runs to win. They would resume as they left off, adding nine to the total before Morkel got his fifth of the day. Onions stumps left in a mess, the former Durham man heading back to the dressing room for 29. The target dropped to single figures as Parkinson joined Bailey. A boundary and a single from the number 11 brought the target to within one shot. But Mornay Morkel was having none of it. With the first ball of his next over, the game was sealed. Another sensational catch from subfielder Will Jacks at short leg had Surrey on cloud nine and Parkinson out for seven. Morkel finished the innings with figures of six for 57 and ensured his side's unbeaten season continued. Surrey add 20 points to move 32 points ahead of Somerset at the top of the table.